You know, there's a lot of lists out there. Best restaurant, best dressed. Michael Rathbone and I of the Show Me Institute have looked into how the Missouri economy has done over this decade. Hi, I'm Rick Hay for the Show Me Institute, and what we're finding is that the Missouri economy just isn't growing like most of us wish it would. We looked at Missouri's economic growth during the good times from 2000 to 2007 when the rest of the economy was growing and what we found was that not only did Missouri lag behind the United States economy but also its neighbors. Since that time during the Great Recession and the aftermath not only did we suffer about as badly as our neighbors but we didn't bounce back. And in the end, what that means is that income in Missouri is about $7,000 less than what it would be if we just increased from 2000 to the present at about the average. In the period from 2000 to 2007, what we found is Missouri's job creation lagged the, the national economy and also lagged our neighboring states. And again, since the Great Recession occurred in 2008, Missouri still lags most of our neighboring states in the U.S. economy. To put it in concrete terms, if the Missouri economy was growing at, at the average of everybody else, we'd have about 40,000 more jobs in Missouri than we do today. Economic growth in Missouri in the future will probably lag our neighbors, which means businesses will locate in other states, and people who are looking for a place to live, a place to start a business, will more likely go to another state than they will Missouri. On the evening of June 12th, Grover Norquist will be speaking about 2014 and the battle in the states. He'll be speaking at the World Chess Hall of Fame in the Central West End. There will be a reception at 5.30, followed by his remarks at 6.15. We'd love to see you there. Please go to showmeinstitute.org and click on the Events tab to register.